What's going on, good people? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Uh, do better. Do better. I can't even speak. <laughs> do better things with your time. If you're in cryptocurrency, it's your fault. Do better things with your time. Learn about the blockchain. Learn about how crypto works. Because that's where the world is moving towards. If you understand technology, if you understand finance, you don't even have to under, understand finance to an expert of a, you know, a PhD or an, ex, an expert. You know things change over time. I remember in the 1990s when the internet really uh, hit the masses. In the United States, AOL was the thing, America Online. People were against it. People were against creating their own emails. They thought that Big Brother was watching them, that, you know, this was something that was very uh, daunting and, you know, doom and gloom. Like 1990, early 90s. 30 years later, here we are with the internet, World Wide Web. Can't get away from it internet of things everything is slowly and surely being connected to the web here we have crypto approaching 11 years in existence imagine 10 years 20 years 30 years from now what it's going to look like many countries shout out to the countries that offer zero tax rate on your crypto they see the vision. There are a handful of countries who are still resistant to crypto. If you're in crypto, it's your fault. But there are a bunch of a handful of countries that are extremely resistant to cryptocurrency. Sad to say, I guess they're stuck in the 70s or the 60s. They probably think this world is just, you know, revolving around those time periods. Who knows? At some point, you have to just, you can't really think about that anymore. You have to really think about what's taking place now to prepare for what's to come. That's it. Ignore the noise. Leave the distractions alone. Don't get involved with, with, the, with the drama. Don't get involved with the crazy stuff. You know? And even those of us who are in crypto again it's your fault if you're in crypto that's the simplest thing that's the truth if you're doing things with your crypto that you have you shouldn't really do because you know there's a high chance of you losing your crypto that's all your fault it's your fault <laughs> it's your fault you know if you're doing things with your crypto to because you're understanding and you're learning about the technology, it's your fault. The onus is on you. The onus is on us. No one else. That's part of what makes crypto revolutionary. That what That's part of what makes it groundbreaking and game-changing. Because the onus is on us. It's on you. Plain and simple. If you have countries who are crypto-friendly who are providing zero tax rates on crypto. Do the research, it's out there. This is factual information. If you have countries that are providing these incentives to those who engage in crypto, what do you think the future is going to look like? It won't be a thing where crypto will disappear anytime soon. That's just my opinion, okay? You don't want to be left behind because at, at some point, see, these are the times right now, these are the days and these are the times where 
just like with the internet when it first you know hit the masses there's a there's there's a lot of room for trial and error and there's a lot of room to accumulate there's a lot of chances people had to accumulate sure this market today you know some people consider it a bear market right and instead of being sad and instead of being uh, uh, worried about the fiat value of the crypto lessening or decreasing or going down change your perspective if you understand where the future is headed now is a great time now is a great time for those who understand what crypto is bringing to the world now is a great time to accumulate never am i offering financial advice because i'm not a financial advisor period i enjoy sharing information and providing some some level of entertainment so once again that's just what it is you know i don't talk about other coins that i don't care for or blockchain doesn't mean that they don't work it just means that you know they don't interest me stellar lumens and and you know ada and 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 these other projects they just don't interest me i'm not saying they don't have a purpose they just do not interest me i'm looking at what the projected uh forecast is saying even though we can't really predict anything right we can't predict what's going to happen but we know for certain this thing isn't going anywhere it's not going anywhere imagine when bitcoin when private transactions are officially set and created on top of bitcoin by way of you know the lightning networks or mimble wimble imagine what what what's going to happen because there's constant good news that are taking place but you know the 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 good news and, and as far as price actions is not really reflected in the market so you'll have you know a piece of good news that comes out and then you'll still see you know i guess bitcoin price dropping right so people are turned off by that they say things like oh you know i'm just going to get out this is a waste of time whatever whatever instead of looking at it as an opportunity to accumulate instead of looking at it up as an opportunity to accumulate if countries are offering zero tax rates for your crypto for crypto for transactions taking place in crypto very 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 telling and i feel sorry for the handful of countries that are anti crypto i feel sorry for the those countries and in a sense i'm not i sorry and like they say sorry but not sorry because there are alternatives study the blockchain and understand what it's about you know this is why people like sunny who have developed a, a smart contract to help the people of india where that's one of the countries that are completely anti cryptocurrency you are cutting out over 1 billion people on the planet from interacting with cryptocurrency when you know that this is where everything is moving towards this is what's you know the wave of the future and you are not allowing your 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 countrymen and women to participate in this market it's going to cause a huge disservice and sunny created the contract as an antithesis to fight against that to allow his people to interact with it because he sees the vision and again this is why i like the project gandhiji that i o people can say it's slow moving people can say whatever but that's one example of how a person is trying to you know resolve an issue that's that's pretty much failing their people you know the countries that are not crypto friendly and and all want to introduce strict regulations to crypto are missing missing the big picture if right now you can you know uh, you know accumulate monies right now right now while you're ahead of the curve before before the real mass adoption takes place and they're not taking advantage of it you are cutting yourself out of the game as a country 
you're cutting yourself out of the game. Reduce it back to us as individuals and, and citizens of our own native lands. If you see where this is headed, take part in it. Learn about it. At least learn about it and see what it means and see what's going. Everyone is not storing money in their mattresses. Everyone is not doing that, you know, especially the young people, the young millennial uh, 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 millennials and, and people under 30 years of age. They understand the tech. This is the future, right? They say the children are the future. They understand the tech. They understand where it's headed and they're taking complete advantage of it as they should as they should because this is where everything is 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 lying right take advantage the onus is on you good bad or indifferent that's it do better things with your time do better things with your time stop wasting time stop stop you know uh uh, uh getting caught up in 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 scandal in 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 fanfare that just produces nothing 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 tangible to help feed yourself and your loved ones stop altogether learn about the information the education is really really important it's pertinent it'll help you help others it'll help you help yourself first and then help others and this is the moment right now where people need to educate themselves about crypto in truth Educate yourselves about the cryptocurrency that's out there. Educate yourself about the blockchain technology and what it means. Not just about gambling. Not just about doing these things that's just, you know, like you passing your time away. That's It's more than that. It's much more than that. It's much more than that. Because as easy as it is right now to open an account in Coinbase, quote unquote easy, it's still, you know, you got to jump through hoops and hurdles, Kate know your customer self, whatever, whatever. But at, which, what I'm saying is as easy as it is to obtain or accumulate crypto, if you wish, through Coinbase, it won't be that easy by way of scarcity. It won't be that easy. It may be that easy, but you won't be able to accumulate the amount that you can accumulate today. You won't be able to accumulate five, ten years from now. If everything is moving the way it should, you won't be able to do it like you could do it now. Now is the time. Now is the time for you to wake up. Now is the time for you to take action. Now is the time for you to understand what's taking place and to see and be aware of what's going on around you and around the world from a geopolitical perspective too. This is the fourth industrial revolution they're talking about here. That we are existing. We are existing within the same time period. We're witnessing the changes take place. Wake up. We're witnessing it. And we can participate in it. So wake up. Understand what's taking place. Learn about it. And make the best decisions that are right for you. But once again, and I'm going to say it again. If you're in cryptocurrency, it's your fault. If you want to do whatever it is that you want to do, it's still your fault. You want to listen to people who don't know what they're talking about and blindly follow them and make the choices that they've made to get into nefarious, shady, villainous projects. It's your fault. If you want to get into cryptocurrency and get into projects that have that have, um, you know, solid foundations, they have a, a, a purpose, they have a mission for more than just having a simple white paper. It's more than that, that they're doing things and effecting positive and real life, real world change. Do that. And it's still your fault for getting into it. Either way, you have to be accountable for your own actions. Don't blame someone else. Don't blame someone else. Blame yourself. I'm out.